Hey guys, I'm back. So today is the 11th. Technically it's the 12th because it's 12.50 a.m. So I guess technically today is July 12th. And I have two things that I want to talk about today. Today I'm going to be talking about First of all, why did I not know it took so mother effing long to upload a video to YouTube? Did anybody else know that? I mean, probably everybody who's ever uploaded a YouTube video, right? But I didn't know it took like an hour. I thought it was like an upload, like, quick five minutes at most. But like, they have to like check everything and stuff. Who knew? Also, I found out, I found out you could make it like private. Like, so only I could see it. And I suppose that, like, that would have been, like, the safe option. But, like, I feel like it's more fun to make it public. You know what I mean? And then there's a thing where, like, if you had a link, you could watch it. But then I was like, just make it public to everyone. Because then I thought, like, what if I got logged out of this account or whatever... And I don't want to, like, lose it. You know what I mean? Capturing my teenage years. <sighs> Today, I want to shave and laser. But it's already 1 a.m. And then tomorrow, I'll also have to wake up early. Because I have to go to um, the island and, like, go through like all the beaches because okay so basically you know how I mentioned that my birthday was recently well it was July 2nd and today is July 12th as I said and I still haven't had a mother -fing birthday party and I haven't even planned it because I don't know what to do like I have zero ideas so first I thought like maybe here at my house and have like a pool party but like it's actually suffocating to be in like the pool room because it's, like, inside, and, like, there's no air, I don't know, it's just, like, it's ugly, and so then I didn't want to do that, so then I was, like, oh, let's do a party at main event, well, actually, first I wanted to do a party at Chuck E. Cheese, because I was, like, oh my gosh, yes, I want the wrap to celebrate me, I wanted the wrap, like, I, if, I, if I was going to have a party host, it was going to be that rat, you know what I mean, it was going to be Chuck E. Cheese, but then I was, like, it cost the same amount of money to have a party at Chucky e. Cheese than it does to have a party at main event. So then I was like, let's do main event because they have like laser tag and stuff. It'll be more fun. Right? So then I was like, yeah, main event, main event. And there's like one where it's like teen teen all access and then there's like the ultimate fun pack or whatever the fuck. And then like the more and more we talked about it, the less and less I wanted it because from the beginning, I kind of wanted like a floor picnic garden party at the beach vibe. And I live, like, an hour away from the beach, so it would be, like, super easy. Well, not, like, super easy. It's actually going to be kind of hard, I feel like, but pretty easy to, like, how you say, do, you know what I mean? Because I saw a TikTok from this girl. Her name's Allie on TikTok, and she's actually, like, so pretty Disney princess core. Like, I love her so much. Like, I want to be her. And I saw her have, like, a, one of these for her birthday. Except she lives in San Diego, so the beaches are nicer. Because where I live, the beach is actually disgusting. Like, the beach... There's worse beaches in the world. Okay. There's worse beaches. This beach is not that bad. But it's not a nice beach. And it's, like, the only beach that people here know. Like, because where I live... People don't really travel. Like, everybody here kind of just, like, you're born here and you die here. You know what I mean? Like, that's the type of town I live in. Like, you either leave and you never come back or you never even leave. And that's just, it's the way it is. It's the way it is where I live. I would be one of those people that leaves and never comes back. Because maybe I would stay here if it stayed, like, only Mexicans. But slowly and slowly, everywhere I love is being, like, gentrified and it's, like, being overfilled by like white people from California and it's like bothering me because it's like you're not supposed to be here and everything is like so expensive and it's just it's really annoying and inflation and stuff anyways my favorite beach 
And the reason I say that the beaches here are ugly and everybody here loves the beaches is because I am used to beaches in like Acapulco. Acapulco, Mexico. That's my favorite. That's like my home, I feel like. It's my home. I spent every single Christmas there, every single summer there for so long. And then we stopped going for like family reasons and then eventually the apartment got sold and now I haven't been since I was like in like four years and it's yeah but it was like it's like my favorite place I love it except that recently like the past like three times I've gone my mom hasn't been able to go either because like I don't even know what's up with her visa honestly I don't know if she has one I think she has one. I know she has one because I know she didn't come here illegally like she didn't like we literally used to take like family trips like Europe and stuff so like but like she can't like leave I don't even know bro whatever so and like it's not as fun when your mom isn't there you know what i mean like you want your mommy there with you i want my mommy with me at all times i don't know so yeah anyways back to the birthday party and even though the beach here is ugly i still feel like it'd be cute and fun to have like a little like picnic at the beach or, like a picnic with like a table here i'll go get my phone and like show you a video of like what i mean Just plug this in real quick. Ali Kima is her name, and look. Okay, hold on. Maybe I need to put the brightness down. Perfect. Let's re. I want that. Except obviously it's gonna be worse because I'm like poor. I don't know. It's my fifteenth birthday, so it's a little bit melancholy. Like birthdays are always sad for me. Like I always cry on my birthday. Like I'm just. I don't know why birthdays are just always sad for me I don't really know why they're not really that special to me I don't know whatever but this is like my 15th birthday which is like really important because I'm like Mexican and everybody's having like quinces and stuff and I don't know I lied to my mom and she's like would you even want a quince and I'm like literally it would be so boring because like nobody would come but it's like you know what I mean? Like, as a kid, I literally used to say that I would have a quince and a sweet 16. And, like, you know what I mean? And at the time, as a kid, it would have been possible for me to have a quince and a sweet 16. Like, for my first communion, I had, like, a whole fucking venue. Like, the party for my first communion, for my first communion, cost, like, basically the same as a quince. And I had that for my first communion. And then I got a quince. Times change, honestly. I don't know. It's really weird. Um, in my last video on my YouTube fail, I talked about in the deleted clip about how it's really weird because I used to be like pretty well off, like pretty like nicely comfortable financially, and now I'm not. So it's like very odd. I feel like to go through that because I still like feel like I'm rich, except I'm totally not. But, like, I feel like my sister's probably the most well-adjusted to being poor. And then it's me, and then it's my brother, who's not well-adjusted at all. Like, he... Because he grew up for the first 12, 13 years of his life having everything he wanted given to him. Like, gold watches, Rolexes. He, like, started learning how to fly planes. You know what I mean? He always had his own... He had his own personal Cadillac golf cart with his initials on them. Like, he went on golfing trips with my dad, like, all over the United States. Like, he, you know what I mean? Like, obviously, he's not going to be well-adjusted, but. And, honestly, the quality, oh, also, the quality here looks bad, like, on the computer. But then, when I uploaded it to YouTube, why was the quality actually kind of good? And that's why I'm filming on the computer again still in photo booth i might like but i'm just not gonna do such long clip i feel like i don't know i don't really have anything else to talk about today i do 
going to clean my room. I want to watch a movie while I laser, except I never, like, I start watching a movie when I do, like, my little laser treatments, and then I never finish watching the movie, just because I get tired of, like, looking at it, because I'm, like, because I usually do it late at night, obviously, but school is, it was announced that school starts August 14th. I don't know, kind of excited to have a routine again, though. I don't know how I'm going to go to sleep tonight. If it's like tomorrow, I have to wake up early. And today, since I woke up early, I slept like three hours. I, like, I woke up at 9.44. How am I supposed to sleep tonight, bro? Do I think my nose is nice? I don't know. I'll see you later. Let's see my side profile. Let's see the other side. Okay, I'll see if I look goofy. <sighs> I don't know. I have a friend, speaking of appearances, I have a friend who's actually, she's so pretty. She's constantly getting attention from boys and stuff. And she's still, like, is literally like, oh, I'm, she either complains about being too fat or too skinny. And then she's always, like, like, she did, like, an Instagram, and she was talking about how she couldn't have Instagram because she couldn't stand to see skinny girls in bikini. In bikinis, but it's like she's a she's a skinny girl in a bikini, and literally like she talks about like being too fat to like me, and I'm like you must think I'm obese, you know what I mean? Like I can't like, and in my mind she's basically like calling me like obese because she's like fucking tiny. Like I think her arm is this thick, not joke, no joke. Like her arm could fit in here. Like I could go like this, and her and like her wrist would be there. And it's, like, fine. I'm not skinny shaming. It's just, like, like, I don't know. It's kind of, like, one of those things where it's, like, crying me a river. So, I guess, it, like, I saw a video of Khloe Kardashian being, like, God is fair. Um, being, like, God is fair. Like, you can't have them all. And I guess since she's so pretty, I guess she might as well be humble, I suppose. I'm shaping my nails a little bit. Oh. It was Amazon Prime Day. To, it started today. And I bought so many things and I'm so excited for everything. I'll tell you everything I bought and then I'll probably do a haul when it gets here. So maybe I shouldn't tell you what I buy. What I bought. That way I can do a haul when it gets here. For some reason, my index fingers are always my shortest nails. And I think it's because these are the ones that get like big. Like, can you see? Hold on. See what I mean? Like, these are, this is always my shortest nail. And my pinky is always the longest. I don't know. Is that weird? You know what I'm really confused about? How can you get famous on YouTube? Like, how'd you start that? Like, do you have to tell people? Or what if just, like, one person watches it and it's like, oh, you're so funny? I don't know. I posted, I started, I said today officially I'm going to start posting on my private story, I guess, like close friend story on Instagram, because today I just like posted a tip, like a reel that I was like, this is so lol, except I realized I need like kind of like a private Instagram that way I can just like post wherever the fuck I want without it having to be on close friends, um, but like, I don't know how I would advertise that. You know what I mean? How do you even do that? I don't know. What do you think? Is it nice? Is that even? I don't know. Anyways. <sighs> what else? Today I went out. And I thought we were going to go to Walmart. We didn't go to Walmart. I wanted to go to Walmart. I enjoy going to Walmart. I'm a big fan of going grocery shopping. Like, I don't think I'll ever not enjoy going grocery shopping, honestly. 
like I've always loved going to Walmart because I don't like spending money on what I feel like are unnecessary things. Like everything I buy is always practical. Like you're never gonna see me buying like unnecessary, like dumb. Well, you might like every once in a while, but like you, d you rarely see me buying like. Like I'm well, maybe I do buy things that I don't need, like all my makeup and things like that. But usually the things I spend my money on are, are like body care and like makeup and like soaps and like things like that you know what I mean that's usually just the way it is it's the way it is and that's what I because that's what I like I also really like baking I love baking my sister leaves for college in August and my brother left for college last year which means it's just gonna be me and my mom at home and she's also going to be teaching me how to drive. Me and my mom already fight. <laughs> like, I can feel, like, like, I can feel, like, our relationship straining over the course of me learning how to drive. Honestly. Ugh. Oh, also, birthday related. Um, my godparents, who happen to be my neighbors... Also, my godparents, who happen to be my neighbors, um, the, my, madrina, godmom, I don't know, um, don't tell me that I butchered that, because I can't speak Spanish while I'm thinking in English, and right now I'm thinking in English, so don't even, okay, um, but she literally called my mom being like, what should I get her? What should I get her? My mom was like, I literally don't know. Like, I can't even shop for my daughter because she doesn't fucking like anything. So, like, don't know what to tell you, girl. And so then she was like, okay, we'll go drop off money, like, today or tomorrow or whatever the fuck. Why call if you're not going to give a present? You know what I mean? Because she didn't even come. She just kind of, like, called. She didn't even talk to me either. She just called my mom and was like, what should I get her? Like, they don't even, like, come inside or anything. They kind of just are like, happy birthday on a card. I don't know. I don't know. I, like, completely filed down my nails way too much. It's okay. They're just nails. They grow. They're just nails. All for wanting to run them out. But yeah, they haven't dropped off anything. And I thought I was going to get money. Like, I really only care about the gifts. Like, I do not. Like, I really never see them. Like, I don't really care about them. So, I don't know. Like, I know that's kind of, like, ugly to say, but, like, it's true. But, yeah. Anyways, did I mention why? I don't even think I mentioned why I'm having a birthday dilemma. Because it's still not planned, and then we mentioned it to my brother, because, obviously, we need him to help. Because my mom and my sister would leave early to go sit up, and then he would, like, take us if that makes any sense. Like, he would take me and my friends to the place where the picnic is. And so, that was, like, the plan. But then my brother was like, I don't think it's a good idea because, like, you have to, like, take all the things onto the beach and then you have to take them back and blah, 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 blah. But then also, I feel like he just doesn't want a mother can help. Like, he's such a boy. Like, he never wants to help with anything. Like, he's so, like, I don't want to say, like, selfish, but, like, he is. I feel like, like he is, I feel like, I don't know, anyways, but like he is, and my mom was literally, like, my mom literally has to like beg him to do things, because he literally won't do anything, like on his own, like he's so annoying, but yeah, and then he like put a bunch of like doubts in my head, about like, about it and it like it just really annoyed me because i was like so sure 
and like confident in this beach floor picnic idea and then he completely ruined it and it made me really sad because it's like you know what I mean anyways I also need to find an outfit I was looking at my sister and she was like he literally just said that because he doesn't want to help like just like literally because he doesn't want to be involved because he doesn't want to help and I was like oh you're right I guess But, like, I don't know. <sighs> I struggle doing this, I feel like. I feel like filing my nails should be easier, but I don't know. That's kind of, like, the only topics I have, really. I could talk more, but I think I'm just going to end this here.